upgrades by through being heard through a curative as a matter of vital constitutional importance, which means that we have we have begun to discuss it with the merit that it deserves. I think I'm very happy to hear that discussion to not reduce this to particular minority concerns to questions of narrow protections under the law, but to say questions of equal dignity of fraternity are at the heart of the constitutional resolution. So I think our expectation has already begun to be met because we're back to talking about sexuality not in diminutive terms in terms of you know pornography or rights or sex but actually in terms of personhood in terms of dignity in terms of what makes us human what makes all of us human right sexuality is not the domain of lgbt people sexuality defines all our collective humanity and the minute anyone's sexuality is diminished as part of their identity all of us are diminished by that so our expectations is that it will be treated as a matter of constitutional rights and equality and the minute you see it that way there's only one resolution you can come to because either all of us are equal or none of us are equal you know there's a whole bunch of things a lot of this has been covered by both uh, by both Gautam and uh, you know Aditya but I think the point really is that you're you're talking about a law that uh, you know a bench of a supreme court which says you are too small to matter I don't think in a democracy which which stands by a constitution you can say that I mean there are, there is there are so many places at which to argue that you you cannot tell anybody you are too few to matter every you know a democracy is meant to make everybody equal like Gautam said either everybody is equal or everybody is not. To say that it's okay for some people to not be equal is to do exactly what the caste system says. That you can be many and you can be unequal. Then you can be small and you can be unequal. And we can't, we can't really stand by judgments or social orders which support inequality or hierarchy and say that this must be maintained. You know, whether it is a religious perspective, whether it is a gendered perspective, whether it's a perspective focused on sexuality, they're all asserting a certain kind of norm on everybody else.